Chris Murray from Autodesk. In this tip and trick video, we're going to take a quick look at something new in 3ds Max 2011, and that's using the shift click loop selection. Let's take a look. Another feature we've added is the ability to quickly select rings and loops of sub-object elements. All I have to do is select any sub-object element, in this case a polygon, hold down my shift key, and you can see that it automatically selects all of the other polygons in that ring. If I select this polygon and hold down the shift key, notice it automatically selects all of the other polygons in that loop. So it's a very quick and easy way to do multiple selections of rings and loops and their appropriate sub-object counterparts.